Welcome, in front of me is a Vivo X80 Pro and today I'll show you how you can go through the setup of this phone. So to get started you will want to find your desired language. For me it's already selected a correct one so I'm just going to select cancel and then go to the next page. Now here you can choose your location, uh, it's not selected a correct one but honestly I think the time zone is the same so it doesn't really matter. Moving on to the next page, we have some user agreement. You can read this entire thing. Select, I agree to the user agreement. I have privacy policy, again, you need to agree to this. You have uh, e-warranty card privacy, whatever. Again, you need to agree to it. And this, you actually don't need to agree to. So, send user and diagnostic uh, information. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna do that. Now here we have Wi-Fi connection page, so you can connect to some kind of Wi-Fi if you want to. If you don't, you have the option to set it up offline, which is what I will be doing. But by doing so, I believe the Google login page won't, won't show up throughout the setup uh, process. And additionally, date and time might not be set automatically. Though both of those things can be changed later on throughout the settings. And if you connect to Wi-Fi later on, uh, date and time will be then automatically fixed up. So I'm gonna skip the date and time right now. And here we have some Google services. So we have location scanning and sending user and diagnostic data. You can read exactly what these do and if you don't like them you can just disable them then go to more and accept this will take you to the next page where you have the option to set up a screen lock we have several different ways of protecting our device so we have screen lock fingerprint and face recognition now for fingerprint and face recognition you will always be required to also have some kind of screen lock the reason for that is if something would happen to your face or your finger you can always access your device using something like a pattern or pin or password so choose one if you want to if you don't you can just skip it right up here now here we have keep the system up to date uh, just a option for automatic system updates which uh, happen usually during the night uh, when you choose this or you can just select it to be installed manually that way you will have to go to the settings uh, and then check for updates yourself on the next page we can choose our navigation style so default one is selected to be the three button navigation the old school one but if you want to you can select gesture navigation if that is something that you prefer using and then congratulations we basically have set up our device so use now will take us to our home screen and there we go so if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching